right, everybody, let's get you out. I know you're not feeling well. It is a little weird uh, weather-wise. People are still getting over this flu or sinus mm -hmm. issues. Mm -hmm. And I know and the, the change, wind doesn't help. The wind doesn't help, and also the change in pressure doesn't help as well. So it all just combines to not make you feel great if you're still trying to get past this. Meanwhile, look at that shot. Beautiful. Looks like a painting, doesn't it? We're out mm -hmm. of downtown Los Angeles. Look at the clouds. Gorgeous right now. Absolutely pretty out there. It's kind of, uh, I wouldn't want to say blustery. It's breezy out there, but it's nice. Nothing major wind wise, but boy, it is super fresh. 64 degrees right now. Downtown winds are calm. The humidity 41%. And that's right where we should be right now. So it is nice. Grab your lunch. If you're in the sunshine, you feel okay. If you're in the shade, you'll probably need a light jacket. 62 over the grade in the Camarillo. Riverside, what's up? 57. San Bernardino not showing a report there, but I know it's 58 right now. Same for Ontario. Fullerton at 62. Cerritos, one of my favorite spots, 62 and 61. Into Santa Ana. So I want to show you the visible sat rad. This just gives you visible satellite is when the sun comes up. We get light. We're able to pick up some of the clouds. You can see the clouds just kind of streaming through the area. Nothing big. When it clears, this is when it was dark. That's why you can tell the difference of visible satellite. It's one of my fun satellite shots. How weird is that, that I would even sit here and talk about a fun satellite show? <laughs> How weird is it that I'm sitting here leaning against the Pacific Ocean as well? All right, so the low pressure area continues off to the east. You can see it's not as destabilized today as we were yesterday. We do have a chance still of uh, some scattered showers throughout the area for us. But right now, the watches and warnings are history. You can see as we make our way through the afternoon, nothing as heavy as what we got yesterday from Santa Clarita, Piru yesterday. We really got spanked. And then out towards San Bernardino County Mountains, we've even removed the uh, winter weather advisory there, but some light snow could continue to fall as we make our way in through the day today. Then you'll see some down to the south, and then I think we start to clear things all up. And all in all, it starts to look well for us. So the low pressure area still continues off to the east. The high is going to start to dominate in through the area, and that's what's going to warm us up. As the high drops down, the low kicks itself off to the east and down to the south. We'll start to go offshore. We'll warm things up, but nothing heavy. Should be nice. We'll pick a nice north northwest flow up, then a little bit of a northeast flow, and all in all, things will look beautiful as we start to make the break towards the weekend. Check out your seven days, 66, 70, 76 for finally a Friday. Look at the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, mid 70s, the beaches, 64, 66 on Thursday. Then we'll start to bring it up a little bit. It's not going to get warm. It'll get back to normal by the beaches for the valley, 67 by the weekend, 82 on Saturday. Quick look for the IE. 63, 72, 80, Saturday. Look at that. Sunday, 78. Monday and Tuesday will come down a little bit. Now, the high desert, 64. We've lost the winds. It's breezy at times up there. Nothing major, though, by the weekend. 80 to 79 on Sunday. And then for a look at the mountains, 39, 47, 56 on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Looking nice as well with highs then. Expected to be right around 63. So, with that, happy birthday again to our favorite seismologist. To well, not birthday. It's, it's not birthday. her day. It's her day. It's her retirement day, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she does a great job.